Hello and welcome. Right, let's turn this time the time down, and that's the very first thing that I do is I want to go straight to the settings, so you know that I haven't been on here before. I want to say that I have tried this map three times, but this particular I'm not happy. I wasn't happy with the first two. I did a new farm start and a start from scratch. This is a start from scratch again, but I want to play it differently. I yeah, I literally. I'm going to do it my normal start, which is when on the start from scratch. We're going to pay the money back. I'm going to go through my settings so you can see exactly what I've got. I want it to be a challenge, but I don't want it to be so much of a challenge that it's awful. Yeah, I'm going to sort of stick to some of the things that I did the second time on the start from scratch, but I'm going to choose different things. Yeah, a, a slightly different uh, mods. I was going for the um, oil mod um, by Bots and V3. It's, I don't know that the thing's quite right and I thought it doesn't really well not that it doesn't suit the map because yeah I'm quite sure you could draw oil from any sort of a country even though obviously you need to be in a good place but so yeah so we're at 300,000 we haven't got any land settings let me just change my settings I want on normal economy I can do it on hard I have done it on hard but right, euros I want to be on dollars yeah, just uh, I really want to be on my. I want that to be on normal. Yeah, fifty minutes auto save, real time, uh, crop destruction, everything's on. I want dirt to be on slow because it really makes no difference. I want that to be on normal. They're, they're all off and everything else is at. I want those to be fifty percent, but slow down because it's still quite awful. And the paint, I really don't think actually does anything at all. Uh, having gone through just a couple of episodes and it's scratching the paint really badly I really don't think it actually does anything at all so then let me show you what we've got in our uh, garage <laughs> which should be absolutely nothing we shall have a look at what is in the sales and we should all oh my life we're that now that is one of the best lineups I have ever seen at the very beginning so do you know something I don't care if we're yeah that that is we're gonna keep everything as is though even if this literally skints us because we've got the makings of a business here we're gonna keep it as is to begin with because I really can't afford anything more and we're even gonna have that as well brilliant okay <laughs> <laughs> well, that's certainly uh, narrowed things down somewhat, but I could not, uh, yeah, I couldn't really avoid that. Now, having looked at this before, um, th this is a long range plan. I shall show you what I did last time. Now, there are only a couple of fields, really, you can go for if you are going to, um, yeah, start from scratch because you've just not got enough money to do anything. Now I chose field 19, plot 25 first time around because it's a very good field, 106%. But, and it is, it's also got the perfect start, although it is split by the river. There are an awful lot of nice, the other beautiful thing about it is it's one of my favourite things to start near the shop and it's right next door. But, yeah, we get one production straight off the bat and this yeah, we get the Yarra great processing. I'm going to feature this because it seems not not the actual farm because we can't really afford that. But I am going to feature raisins and grape juice. So I thought to do this and bearing in mind that that is where the original starts the uh, new farm, which is this here. You get that particular set there, and you get that one field at the top. So we're not going to go for that. But you can see the house and you can see the great processing plan is there so that's what we gain even if we don't get i don't know if this is going to be changed but the minute you get that no matter what you go for field eight is in the middle and it is an awful field but let me show you it's not not selected yeah one hundred thirty thousand. yes which leaves us the grand total of thirty four thousand five hundred and three, <laughs> which is rather a little bit I'm not even sure that I can actually do what I was, what I would like to have done, which would have been to put a generator and go for a year. Now then, what can we afford? Is there anything at all we can afford? <gasps> we could just do it. Yeah, the laws. This is what I went with first time, and this is what I'm going to go with this this time as well. And I believe it's here. Yeah, it is. It's got a blue blob on it now. It's oh, 
or it's done that thing where it goes not enough money you just have to go back in and then out again now I'm not sure it does look like oh, we do I remember seeing this the beautiful thing about this field is you do get that massive patch of fairly flattish where well, it looks fairly flat from up here land we're gonna go though in the the most unobtrusive section of that gonna do the door so that we're facing our field or do it no there's a couple of doors actually so you can't really sort of say anything we're gonna go and now then are we gonna block the way I think we're gonna go as far to the back as you would right next to the water without yeah with it being fairly flat and it's gonna when I hit the edge of that it's gonna say no oh it's going up high so let's go back to 30,000 there we go, we've got 3,956. So then, we are going to, yeah, I'm gonna use the, uh, do what I normally do, which is to go through. Oh, I, I don't believe that. I put the start from spring mod on and it takes you to September. I don't put the start from spring mod on and it starts you in February, go figure. Must be something special about Yara Valley. When I did this, but well, every single time I started, I had start from spring in the two times and it's, and it's literally started in August, the normal month. Now it's obviously supposed to start you early, which is why when you put the start in spring, it does a reversal and starts you in August. So yes, we are right above where the uh, great processing plant is. So we're gonna run down there and we're just gonna go to sleep, um, truthfully. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go through a year and we st uh, stay with my parents for a year. Whoa, that's if I don't kill myself dropping off the edge of the cliff. Thank goodness it's a game. Yeah, there's our windmill, you can see it's in the distance. It's not a sleep trigger. I am gonna put a mat down, but this is what we possess even though technically we don't really own the land but we obviously own the land that it's in so we are going to be using this but we are going to go for one year we've bought all of that bits and bobs of stuff so we really have we've got at least a start in actually have had one of the best starts i've ever seen it's yes it's everything's basic we haven't like been able to upgrade things but i wanted to do this properly and i would like to say we're going to start in Oh, why is the point? Aren't we going to just go to... No, we're going to start next March morning. So we've got like a full year of um, only the money from the generator, which is a considerable amount, but it's not a silly one that does 80,000 a day, but it, it's supposed to be a steady 36,000. Now, I've got to be honest, five out of six months, it did do 36,000 exact, and then a couple of months it deviated and did a little bit less, but it's one of the most steady incomes that I've ever seen on a generator. So we're gonna do what I normally do, we're gonna go for, yeah, we'll, oh, we'll do it eight, because otherwise it does that funny little trick where it goes an hour to nine, and then you have to run around and do strange things. So yeah, I just really, I, all of my normal let's plays, I'm, um, no, it's getting to the end of the week again. I'm not going to say... No, I don't, I don't want to put a downer. Sometimes I think I, uh, I uh, put a downer on things, and I'm not really trying to. Just I can't... Oh, wow, so that's 24,000 for once and not 36. Right, we'll have a look at each one, but obviously we've got very little money. So, and of course... Oh, that we do need. And we will stick exactly... It, oh, it's a 32.5. It is actually the modded one, but it's not the one I normally go for. But I don't really particularly care. That is amazing. And also, we're going to go for that. Absolutely. That is amazing. Because we do need one. We are going to need one. Fantastic. Here we're gonna, I'm going to do this quickly. I'm not going to faff around. Just that you're going to race through and see what... I'm not buying any equipment. We will allow contracts. Um, we will allow bank loans but it is is always frowned upon i really don't like to do bank loans unless it's a bridging loan or if i'm terribly desperate and there's a very good reason that like you just can't that's it thirty six thousand. That that's more like what it uh, normally does oh a mower a, a, a mower i believe it's a baler <sighs> now that we can't afford but it's a shame because that is a cracker but that it's reason it's not that reasonable that is amazing let's go with that for starters uh, that is a I think is it a telehandler oh 
three is whatever you want it to be out of those two. Are we going to take a gamble? No, there's some really good reasonable ones anyway. Not quite as good as that, but yeah, do you know something? No, we will pass on that one. Yeah, we're not going to faff around. Yeah, I, f I felt in need of, and I re there's something about this map that I keep being drawn to, truthfully. I am struggling with all my others. I, I, I had a really stressful one on, well, I'm not intending on staying on Frontier anyway. It was a, a mini series. I do like the map and I would like to do a full series on it, but what I'm trying to say is, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with things being where they are at present. Oh wow, if we're going into trees, now that is amazing. And you can actually change it into a wood harvester. It's amazing. Really is a cracking sort of thing, but yeah, we're not not that's not what I'm intending to do. It's a shame. It's a good price. Yeah, so I'm I'm just gonna do this. This is a bit of fun. I could have gone on the white farm, but I'm wondering whether the white farm is going to be on my next American map. So most of my maps are moving very, very on um, with great pace. So I'm, this is just a little bit of, yeah, this is my end of the week map when I can't um, do the other stuff. Right, keep your eye on the, the, the months. Oh, another IX track. Oh, do we go? Yeah, now this is a tractor. That, yeah, we're going to pull. Wow. Okay, what have we, and 81 horsepower. I think we're going to keep it as is, apart from what I don't know that we're going to go for the. Yeah, I will honestly, I will split it out. That, that's, no, it's not that. This has got so many things. That's it. Yeah, just going to get rid of that. We will have a fiddle with it, but for 12,000, I don't think we can afford to say no. We will probably soup it up a little bit, but for now, that will do nicely. Right, we don't need any of the others. Yeah, it's strange. It's, it does, it's doing what it always does, where your Let's Plays are all at the very advanced stage. And at the end of the week, I really have not, at my age, got the energy for doing monstrous let's plays. So, yeah, I, I build up to it most of the way through the week. I can manage it, and then as I get a bit tired towards the end of the week, I haven't got the mental energy for actually sort of doing that. Now then, let's have a look. That is a 7.6 metre. Do we take a punt on that because you're going to need a header and there's almost everything can actually manage a 7.6 metre header for 20,000 could you really afford to say no no it's it's a bit special isn't it really that's that's good if we'd got uh, yeah one of those but we haven't so wow that farmer is making very quick we all, we've got to remember we're actually are going through the months yeah yeah, I, I suppose you've got to stay true to your energy levels and what you can manage. And it is a shame because I realise I, I, I would have liked to do things differently. I just like to plough on and get through it. Yeah, it, it, sometimes you've just not got the energy. My, yeah, I, again, I don't want to be moaning. Ooh, wow. We will indeed. That is amazing. Right. Well, I've got to be honest, this is so far one of a, a, a very, no, I'm not going to jinx it as that saying is, although not that I believe in that type of thing, but yeah, my grandma always used to say, don't tempt providence. So it is true in a way you're inviting bad. If you say something too good, really, you're inviting it to be, um, yeah, stuffed up. So we don't want to be doing that. Top liner. That is the top liner as well, isn't it? Now that... Do you know, I am going to take a punt on that because if I was going to choose a star harvester, it probably would be the top liner. And its header is normally quite expensive, so do you know, uh, we will do that. I thought, we'd, I thought I'd gone past the month then. Yeah, we did say March. And slightly longer than a year, really, because it started on February. I've never seen the, the actual game start on a February before, but yeah. Yeah, our windmill obviously generates power. That's, yeah, you you can obviously figure that one out. And it obviously it is a, oh, we seem to be having every, every kind of, uh, do we go for, no, no, it's, 
Yeah, really. Oh, wow. Yeah, I've got to be honest, unless it's got strap support, it's difficult to make use of something like that, I always think. It's a shame, though, because it, it, for something at the shop, can I afford to buy that for the shop? I can. An <laughs> another one. Right, well, I think I think one will do us. Yes, we are scouring the uh, sales with the money that we're raising from our uh, energy business. And then we're going to start farming at the uh, beginning of March. Oh, wow. This, we are seeing a lot of action from this farmer. Oh, another one. It's exactly the same. But that would be three. That would be really cracking. That is amazing as well. What is it? What is that? Ah, uh, you can do it tank with arm. What is its reach? That's all I would like. That is amazing. Oh, that's the one. It's the distributor. Yeah, and that, that costs a lot. So do you know what we're going to do? We're going to go for a tank now for 23,000. And we're going to augment all of this. Because for once I'm going to... Mm, but we've already done... Are we going to do that? But you could do it as a tank, a storage tank. Yeah, but not if you're not going to... Oh, it does water as well. Go on then, we'll, we'll do it. We will, because you can do it if it's a water tank. So it's a bit more than I would normally sort of pay. But you know, we're going to go for that as well. And we're going to stick to... Oh, wow, that's 210 horsepower. Okay, we'll go for the smaller one as the one with the front ladder attacher. So it seems we're a massive stronghold this this time, which makes a quite ni a very nice change actually. Yeah, this one is what I am going to do is I am going to feature. I'm going to use the Omatana um, Great Garden uh, because it's more of a time element thing. It is a little bit sort of cheating. Well, it's not cheating. It's not cheating, but it's it more goes with the amount of time that I've got to do things and makes things start more quickly but it's not cheating, it is only using what we've actually got that is a tether, do we really need a tether? that's almost unbeatable over a tether really for the for the price I think we'll, we can't really afford to say no, and it's not a piece of equipment I've had a lot so wow, December's a nice in Australia Yeah, so contracts are allowed, it's mainly bailing, which it actually pretty much is on almost every map now on FS22 because, um, yeah, otherwise you get weeds go prolifically all over the map, and I think almost all map makers are recognising this fact, really. Oh, the sin track. <laughs> Should we do it for once? This did that super duper. I would, wouldn't normally do that, but it, it's a special offer. We, I, I'm gonna, yeah, I've got the sin track on one of that. I would go for it normally because it is beautiful. It really is. It's one of my favourite tractors. Although, isn't doesn't it make a good? Yeah, thinking about what we're gonna go and do, it would suit us. It's just a massive chunk of change. I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna go out on a limb, and it's for a special reason. And that's going to make scanning a little bit of a snippet. Right, okay, Ooh, two months left. We might well have to do some contracts. We might need to borrow some equipment. Yeah, th th I've done that for a special reason. Which might seem madness at present, because we're probably going to have to do a uh, bailing contract before we even start to actually earn a bit of money to actually do anything. Still, I do like a challenge. Sometimes your equipment can make a let's play, so we don't need any more, and we couldn't afford it anyway. Right, last month. Yeah, I think we probably will do a bailing contract definitely to start off, because we're not going to have... Well, we're, yeah, 
we'll see. I don't think we've got enough to do what I would like to do though, because although we've got good equipment, we've not got good equipment, as in it all needs adapting. Ooh, a good cracking. Oh, that's a runner. Well, it would be useful. I, I, I'm telling you why. Because, oh, wow. Yeah, because of the fact, actually, I wouldn't normally buy that because the IT runner actual one is normally quite expensive, but 64% off 3,510 for a 45 cubic meter. That really is good. Are we going to go color? We're going to go blue to match. Oh, I think, yeah, we're going to go. We are going to do it. We're going to do the color. We're going to change it. We're going to go with my... Yeah, well, I love this. And I know this time for once, it really is to save a bit of money. Yeah, it really is. I admit it. There's no other reasoning for this. Um, yeah, I'm going to literally do this to save us a bit of cash. Because it's free. And I know it's a little bit cheeky, but I've always said, yeah. Well, not always, but recently anyway. Wow, that is amazing. If I'd got the money, I would go for that, definitely. But that, likewise, and we're going to keep it that blue because it matches the uh, thing. So, Now, this was very, very heavy. It was. Uh, I've ste steered clear of this. So this is a fantastic chance to actually see if this has changed. And that is, that's it. We're there. So we've got... A, we <laughs> right, we, I don't tab normally. This is not... This is the... Yeah, this is us literally... You know, going down to the shop to take full stock of everything we've got. So we have got a trailer. We have got three, four tractors actually. The Sintrack, which has got, it needs its front. It's got nothing. It needs, they're quite expensive as well. Also, it's going to need repairing. So we've got a Tedder. We've got two masses. The Kuwaiko, which needs changing. We've got this, which I'm going to leave down at the shop. We've got the header. We've got the, the big 9.5 meter one. We've got the um, Valmit, and we've got that to bail. We've got the Hower. We've got the two of these, one which we probably will sell the smaller of the two. We've got the Bertad, one of my favourites. We've got the Bredel, which has become not a favourite. It's not a favourite, but yeah, it is good. So I've got two of these. What was, oh, no, 77 cents. Fantastic. That is good. Let's have a look at the Valmet. How much are you? Oh, 71 cents. Some, some equipment you could almost drive out, which is good. That's 77 cents again. Fantastic. How much are you? I know. Oh, 62. So the, the two biggest tractors are the two most damaged. We can't afford to play around with the Sintrack at the minute. It's going to cost us quite a bit of cash. So it's going to rain today. Let's have a look what time it's going to rain. Because if it's late, we'll do a contract now. Ah, oh, it's not. It's 9 till 10. What we're going to do then is we're going to zip through. Take this until after the rain is gone. We're going to stick with the equipment as it is. I would like to. Oh, can we afford it? Can we sort of done it? We've got a... We would need a windrow, but you can buy a super cheap windrower, really, for under a couple of grand. So that we could do. Should be 10 o'clock then. It's clearing. It's clearing. The weatherman's about as precise in this world as it is in ours. Not exactly. Smash it. Yeah. Right, and I know what, I'm, what I'd like to do. Right, no. Um, contracts. think it is a second yeah it's all right my graphics card no sorry my main fan is uh, it was touching the case I was making a little bit of a note oh we've got a couple of fertilizing contracts why don't we do that three five ten thirteen let's have a look that is fantastic three five ten three five Three and five are right close to each other. I think we're going to do that. that it would be silly to say no, really. So field three, we are going to accept the contract. And field five. And I think we're going to do the challenge in field ten. Right, fantastic. Oh, the liming contract's two, twelve and twenty-one. 
12. Oh, that's not that big. And 21. We're going to do it. We are, yeah. Oh, it won't let me take them all. I'm forgetting them base game. Yeah, as in, like, I haven't got any. So, can we take one more? No, it has got three active contracts. Right, so we've got to hope that they are left for when we're done. Right, let's grab. Now, who is going to make a good one is probably... Is the Valmet gonna do? Is it gonna? No, it's 85 horsepower. No, 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 no. It's not a good idea. Let's go for the first Massey. That was the smaller of the two, 77%. And I'm gonna grab the bread. We are gonna invest in it. We're gonna literally put the extensions on because it makes sense to do this. But we actually, yeah, thinking about it. Yeah, we want the extensions on. And we're gonna buy some stuff from this because we've got nothing else. Yeah, we're gonna stick to the stuff from the shop at the minute. We have got now that I know where this is now. It is anywhere about here, but the actual thing is right the way down here. Oh, is repair and repair and do we? No, we customize that. Oh, it's the biggie! I was thinking you can go large. You, you can't get much larger than that. Yeah, we're going to go for that. I know it costs us quite a lot, but you know, it's got to speculate to accumulate. Right, so we're going to get some fertilizer in that. We're going to go for the lots. I think we'll go for the. Yeah, well, let's just try. I mean, it, this is obviously very, very reasonable. I mean, very, very reasonable. Oh, like, that's right. I couldn't find the the shop's um, way in. I can't remember. I think I had to go off on the... Yeah, I did. I went in the menu last time. Oh. I did see a flash of yellow there. Okay. Right. Well, yeah, I'm going to do it the easy way. Let's just do it from here. And we're going to go for... Pallets for this, and we're going to go for three, which is fifth. Now let's go for four. Let's go for, yeah, if it's four thousand. You really can't beat. It is a fantastic thing. Is there any? Oh no, it don't matter. Yeah, yeah. I was, I was thinking out loud when I didn't th think my thoughts through very well. So yeah, the farm supply back by the lot. Yeah, I know I probably will not need that, but I'd sooner, I, with having the bridle, it's, it is one of the massive advantages to having the bridle is the fact that you can obviously stick so much in and for something like fertilizing contracts, that is really, really amazing. Right, so where has it stuck those? I wanna get set this going as soon as possible. Yeah, my master plan is, so we need a windrower. Now that's not expensive. Whereabouts is it? Oh, it's I can see them. I can see the pallet over there. Yeah, pallets actually. Oh, let's make this realistic. Yeah, I want this to be where everything is as, as real as possible, including grates for things where where possible. I know some of them are a little bit. Um, yeah, I don't normally do this, but really, this is. Yeah, I'd like to hit the ground running with this one, really. And we are sort of quite low on cash because I've spent the fortune on one of the best lineups I have ever, ever had. So I'm really impressed. Very, very much so. Now then, whilst that is filling, when we started the second set in, I'd like to just look at yeah, what I'm aiming for in this Let's Play, which is why I'm so happy that the Sin track has dropped. Yeah, my very favourite mower combination has dropped from FS19. Now I've hoped this would. Uh... Oh, I can't, I'm a little bit too far away. Oh, right. Yes, it is. Mowers. Please tell me why I've actually ticked it as well. Yeah, it is a smaller set of mowers, but it is a combination that you can put together. And it is, yeah, it is a pointinger, but it's my original, the 8.4 meter one which I'm hoping I've ticked, it is the X8ED. It is by Lucas Plays TV. Yeah, absolutely amazing. Now, where is the other one? 
I don't think this does what the original one does, but that's not really a problem. It is 160 horsepower. No, no, we can't afford it at the minute. I was just showing you. <laughs> I'm getting carried away now. Yeah, the Novacat X8. Now, is the other one half of it at the beginning? Or is it just the X8 that drops and you're supposed to have one of the other Poitingers? I'm sure it's a, it's a combination. Yeah, it's got it's got to be the entire thing. Perhaps it's not quite because it is supposed to be a set, and it, uh, yeah. So has it gone wrong or what? It's supposed to be the two, as in you can attach them, but I can't see it I, unless unless no, I've ticked everything. Right, it's brand new. It was only literally a couple of days. So do you know something? Yeah, well, again, that, that's what I'd like to do. Let's just grab this lot in and let's get this going. That's the most important thing is to set this going. Right, so we could actually be clever. Whilst this is... Why have we got animals? <laughs> why have we got animals? I don't get this. Right, so the closest field is field five or field three. So we're going to go for course play... And they are the yeah the two fields that I've had in before. We're gonna go create job. We're gonna start field three. And we are gonna go number of add-ins thirty meters. Two. We'll try. We'll try. Brilliant. Excellent. I'm not going to save the course. We're just going to do it. Right. Brilliant. We're going to fill it. And then we're going to go from course to course with this throughout the session. While we do a, I think... Oh, no, we can't. We've got the... Yeah, that is true. Do we start with a standard? Because it looks to me very much like that. Actually, it's not gone. It's not gone right. Something's not quite right. Whether I need to come out and go back in, or but I mean, it really should be as simple as we do that. So field. Now this is quite a way off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to scoot down the. Uh, I'm not going to run uh, Grandma and Gramp over. Really not. Although it did look very much like I did. Right. I'm going to see you down on field. Three. See you shortly. Right, I'm starting the cameras. That is almost yeah untenable with that particular Massey. It's too light, even though it seems to be a fairly strong tractor. It's not heavy enough. Although I'm not sure this one's going to be. It is the slightly stronger of the two. I think what we're going to have to do is grab a weight and run this one after it, and we might need to swap tractors. Typical. <laughs> Typical. Right. Okay then, so we need to grab a weight to make this up. Oh, the one thing I've always said about Masses is, uh, yeah, I had a 280 horsepower one on one of the Let's Plays that I never did do. No, I didn't ever sort of like air it. But yeah, it was, um, it's too light. Even though the horsepower said it could manage the planter, it couldn't actually manage the planter because it was too... Yeah, it needed a weight on the front to actually steady it down to, to make the weight of the Massey like good enough that it could actually cope with the weight of the planter and then the power of it so yeah it is that's the i'm not not so not what saying what i've got against them but it is one of those things right so i'm going to go for the pass through my normal reutering and we're also going to go for the one straight next door and we're going to go black my favourite two course. I nearly always choose these for this. At 900. So this is a 3.2 ton weight when you stick the two together. Yeah. So then I would imagine they're probably over the other side. Yeah. And then we're going to go down and we're going to like, literally, I should meet you back down there. But yeah, I, it was unfortunate. Right. I need to do this the other way. Yeah. Well, they're, they're both. And I can't get used to the fact that this is left-hand drive. I keep on wanting to drive on the right-hand side because I'm. I know it's dollars, and and it's but it's not America. Just I just can't get over it. I just somehow keep thinking it's. Uh, yeah, I forget that it's left-hand drive, the same as in Britain. You'd think I was European or something, but yeah, no. Right. 
I'm going to meet you down by field three, and I'm hoping by the time we've got the bread all left hand side, you've just said that. Yeah, it's a bit now. It's a bit front heavy typically. Right, I'm going to meet you down on field three. See you shortly. This has actually yeah got the the uh, worker somehow got stuck, and I have no idea why because there was nothing in its way whatsoever. But this is the actually the the farmyard, the, the standard farmyard that you get on new farmers, and I do like the way that the buildings don't disappear. It's uh, so awful that on a normal start from scratch, how they ooh. Did not realise this was. Otherwise, I might have. Yeah, there's any trouble with this. Realistically, this would not be able to do this. But I'm going to go with what the. Right. Okay. Let's hope that that can cope with that, and we'll grab friends. And yeah, this is a slightly more powerful one. Let's just see how that copes. From the distance, I think I'm going to time lapse this because I'm going to try to get all three of these in. And are we going to try to do a mowing contract as well? Yeah, it would. True. What we could do is get rid of the very first contract and then take one of the others. So let's study our mark, shall we say? Let's have a look. Which contract are we going to go for? It wouldn't be a bad idea to do one that says no. It seems to be managing. So it is. Now, are there any bailing contracts? I said there was loads of bailing contracts, and there are always oh, one. Field two. It's header. And bail it. Mm, okay, well, well, I'm not feeling it. I'm not not with that. It's typical. When I started, it, it was literally... And it's March, I suppose, really. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit early in the season, so perhaps... Yeah... I'm trying to think, is there anything we can do with fifty-four thousand? Actually, start? No, no, no. Well, I think we need to earn a bit of cash. We, I really have sort of done this, so it's sort of quite, um, it's quite tough. But I am going to say my words. Yeah, we're going to go to a time lapse, and I'm going to jump into that tractor. I think, so that we can at least see what we're doing. So I'm going to say my words. I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side. Just thought, do you know, there is stuff we can be doing, really. We could grab the Valmits and we could do the scanning now, which is the biggest one. That is the one that I'm, yeah. Let's have a look. I can't really tell. I mean, they're both fantastic, but yeah. I, I wouldn't normally go for this. It's a bit like going for the Omatana, the big one. Oh, now this is the biggie. Now, this is going to scan so much, it's unbelievable, which is why I wouldn't normally go for it but you know it's it came up in the sales i wouldn't buy it as a choice normally but for what we're trying to do and the other thing is i have got equipment that i can be taking down to the farm so just to me it seems a little bit more sensible that we actually do that as well do the scanning if i can actually find the sweet spot fantastic i think well yeah we'll probably uh yeah, now this is, I think you can stick, I'm sure I can stick a front loader on there, a, a front three point. Let's have a quick look, just see how much that is. Uh, fenders, engine, we'll leave at the minute. Frame. It's just got some very strange... No, we won't. Let's go out and in again. I want to start it as it was. Ah, maybe it has only got the... Uh... Okay, 
I don't think I think yeah it doesn't I don't think it has got it's got to be weights perhaps that's oh no Yeah, this is one of the ones that I struggled with to actually get it to work when I was using manual attach. Standard with simple hydraulic command. So it looks very much like, oh. Did I do that? Do you know something? Yeah, we'll do, that, that'll do nicely. It could not cost us anything. Wow with the uh, fantastic right okay then so then we can yeah we can use this for light duties and we could also in time use it for other things as well I'm, it, it was not it's a nice tractor I took it out with great regret really and I always said I'd like to give it another shot so uh, it had got had a couple of updates so I thought why not you know I can't afford the front we're gonna this is gonna be a long-term plan to fix it up really so we can we can leave that up at the shop and we've got both of the masses down at the bottom so we could no we can't yeah it's true right we're gonna go and scan then at least the very least it is a fairly fast tractor as well and the other thing is I realize I haven't actually shown you the map yet and it is a beautiful map yeah quite unique so, yeah, there's a lot of left-hand drive, Mr. Smith. Will you get it in your head? This is, yeah. It was here we got stuck for some reason. It just suddenly started the uh, the, the tractor a few minutes ago. It just literally st got stuck. At, I don't think it was that one. I think it was further on. I remember left-hand. This is just like being in Great Britain. Straight across as normal. And it has got a working train as well. Water's a very interesting colour. Now that on the hill is pretty much where we're aiming for. So that that's um, field that you see on the left would not be able you can see the great things in it. This is what was a little bit strange about it on mine. It was got it said it had got oats, but it had also got the the stakes. So I'm not sure what that's about, really. Yeah, that would be a bit of a struggle. It is only 85 horsepower. I do like the Valmets. I love the Valtra. It was my um, very first tractor in FS22. The um, yeah, I had to buy one brand new. There were so many, so few mods, uh, and it was actually no, it was full price. I actually did pay full price. I wanted a tractor that was 190, 170 horsepower. Let's undo this. And let's do our field is all I'm going to say. But you can see by how green the map is, it does a humongous great area. Now, if we look at the that, does it show you the area? I've never tried to do it. Like, no, it doesn't. Yeah. Now, I suppose what we could do then for once is do that. We're going to have to with this monster. You can see that they're quite happy to do field six all in one. Now, I think this has been changed, or there's a bigger one, because I, I had this on St. Cali when it first came out. I didn't realise it actually had extended range, and I literally did a quarter of the map. I know St. Cali is a small map, but you can see this will do most small to medium fields in one single scan, which is quite phenomenal, because this is not that small a field. So what we should do, if we're going to buy these fields going forwards, we could really try and scan a bit of field 5 and 8. It would be a little bit crafty. Fantastic. Now then let's uh, put that back to normal. I do like it on my precision farming. Let's fold that away. This is not a very nice field. Right, so we need to be sending that to the next field and we want to be taking... Oh no, we've just said there aren't any contracts. We could take 
there was some liming contracts. Or do we get a buy a limer as well and do some buy some lime? Right. Okay. Let's grab. Yeah, it's nearly finished. Let's uh, jump into that. If we were on the right screen. Right, fantastic. Finish the job as well. Right, field 5 and field 10. That's as a, yeah, this is where we're going to swap the... Because this really is a bit of a stretch for this. It really is the heavy bread. Although it's not got a horsepower requirement, it is nevertheless very heavy. 27.2, so 21 tonnes of weight. So it is a little bit... A little bit of a stretch so this is the same frame then as the other one it's just that the other one is slightly strong more powerful i was gonna say stronger but yeah wow wheel slip or what realistic though fantastic wow we used eight percent Right, I think we'll send this up to the shop, and I think we will. We're going to buy a limer as well, and I know we've got a bread or but you, yeah. I, or do I? Do I do that? Or do we go for? No, no. I, it is. I, we'll, we'll just stick to the one. We will. It's silly. Yeah, it really is daft. And if any was going to be the limer, it would be this one, really. Let's get the other one done up this end. Right, so let's take. Collect on the contract. And we want field five, which is also this way on. You say. It is, I just can't remember which direction it is. straight behind us and it is a fairly big field yeah that way there Ooh, so, so we came up that hill for absolutely no reason what all apologies that wall wow this is still slipping even with the weight Yeah, I am going to go into a time lapse. We're going to get these two contracts done because it is going to be... It would be a bit boring for me to just take you along as just normally and just to chitter-chatter. So I am going to say my word. I'd really like to say thank you very much for watching. I truly do hope that you're going to stick with me on this journey and I'm going to say goodbye for now.